Hello guys, hello! Day 28 already of the October Tangles Challenge. A few more to go and today I have a nice organic tangle, flower botanical tangle, which is one of my favorite styles as you know. Uh, the name is Effie, it's by Annette Rümpler. <laughs> my, my German is not my strong point. And you can see here that I have added these uh, background lines to complete this style. And now I can just unglue them, separate the two, and work on this one because the other one is finished. It will be easier for me to rotate just one tile. And I will draw Effie here and perhaps also here, I will see. Anyway, I will start right here and then start with a dot and then it might be the bottom part and I'll just draw this dotted line and then add aura lines to draw this flower shape. Not perfect, again, who cares for perfection? Right, it doesn't have to be perfect. Again, no Zentangle police to punish me, because it's less than perfect. Now another one, and I will draw behind Maybe the PN pen is not the best choice for this because I think that might it might be easier with a thinner nib or a finer nib. And then they don't all need to be equally sized. Right, I will start this time with the middle part. I think this will be a better approach. And still, some of them will meet at the bottom. And just one more. That will be partially hidden again. <laughs> I've never I've never done this angle before. I thought it was an easy one now that I've seen the instructions, but it does require some precision to draw it nicely. I will just draw some stems that go from the flower buds to this bottom part. And this one, well I guess I will pre pretend that the stem is in the background, although <laughs> We see well enough that this flower is in a, is on top on this of this one, but still, again, luckily, um, none of the Zentangle police officers are checking on me. And another one, so it starts kind of like a beginning of. Um, an orb. 
maybe if I start with a really narrow bottom part of the petal it will fit in like this and I don't think that I will do another one but I'm seriously considering adding some mukas here now I really miss it too much already I don't know maybe just another one over here <clears throat> And again, I will start with this, these that are kind of in the middle. It's a cold angle. I might add some of these. Oops. I told you already when I was drawing, I don't know what it was before. If you do the flicking, either do, do them towards yourself or from away from your body and not like I wanted to do it now towards I don't know left or right um, I think that's just enough and I will oh, I decided against Mooka not because I don't miss Mooka because I, I do miss Mooka but um, I have really, if you take a look at this section, I have really covered a lot of the space uh, where the border is supposed to go with tangles. So I want at least a section of the drawing visible, of the border visible and still I'm not going to draw it all the way but at least some of it and now the shading which I think will be easier for this angle I will just play some shades, place some shades around this central orb. This one I would have to mark down so that I remember to use it. Sometime in future. totally cute. I will add high uh, shades below. My tangles, this trilina as well. Maybe perhaps, maybe and perhaps. <laughs> Maybe I will first do the highlighting of this angle and then I can play with the shades and everything else also later. I mean the shading of the background part and do the angle while filming the video.
I might maybe sharpen this right now. I don't have my electric sharpener, but I have a handy one. <coughs> So that I can be more precise in these tiny spaces. And then, of course, my blending stump, and I'll do some blending, not too much. That's really a cute tangle. I'll just confirm that. <laughs> again and I will say can all five for for these just tiny lines. Maybe also add some whitest highlights. On top of my petals. So now I think this looks better when we have combined the organic tangles next to geometric tangles. Because if I were to place three geometric tangles next to each other, it might seem a little boring. Well, now these geometric tangles are kind of mixed with the organic tangles. And now I will add some background shades and some lines again. But I think that I might end this video and just deal with it alone. I would like to thank you all once again for joining me for this drawing session and only is it three more days to finish the challenge. Yay! I, I will see you tomorrow I guess. Bye!